Hello everyone, welcome back to this channel. Today I will explain you about how to create a dashboard in Jira. So let's see the agenda of the session, then we will proceed further. So I will show you how we'll create a dashboard here, which all components are required, and first of all, what is dashboard? So if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Let's begin with creating a dashboard. So before starting, first of all, what is dashboard? So whenever we are working with any specific project and which require once we log in, we'll see status of any project like defect, print wise or tracking and other details are required that time we'll need dashboard for quick view. So as you can see here, we have I have already created a suit statistics and pie chart of defect. So similar type of dashboard will create it again for your case. For creating any dashboard or any specific content, just click on create where you have to provide your dashboard name. Now yes, here we are you are going to see a issue, but for creating we just have to delete or create dashboard for your otherwise if you want to delete you can delete the previous one. So let's say test demo and description whatever description you are looking for or you are entering it definitely that is available defect dashboard I am adding here so after entering the detail once you will click on save so this will be saved in a private mode and you can see two sides first left hand and right hand side you can add the gadgets or add the gadgets as per your requirement. For adding a gadget, you just have to click on add gadget and based on your requirement, you can select the gadget as well. So bubble chart will show you identify popular and significant issue by displaying data in four dimensions. So let's select this. It will add a bubble chart for us. Next we'll see all first click on load gadgets where you can see all the gadgets are available so here average age chart is also available so if you want to have a look average time in stamp created versus resolved i think by mistake it was closed so next is heat map introductions so let me drag and drop this as well and Jira roadmap pie chart. The pie chart is basically for our different. So now I've selected three components. It's totally up to your requirement how you want to look it or how you want to manage your dashboard. So let me click on close and now first we will create a pie chart. So creating a pie chart, we need to add the project name. Project name because we are looking for defect. So whatever project we have, maximum number of defects, I am saving that here. Click on save. You can see as per assigned and unassigned status, this is showing like this. But we can add it as well. So I want the defect project wise defect or priority wise. So let's see. Now you can see defects are open in priority wise like medium, high, highest, and low. Still, you want to edit it. You can click on this, edit, and select your levels or whatever data you want to show up here so issue type of component not raised version 
assigning big status resolution or project. So let's see here. Uh, it will show up the project wise defect status because we have selected specific project because of that it's showing for that if we have multiple project we will select it we will get the multiple project status here still you can edit it as per your requirement like the resolution or because whatever defects i raised is not resolved uh, so so as per reporter if you want to see with the reporter can but priority is a big thing you can keep with this and say you will get priority wise defects are shorted now next next we'll have issue statistics what are the issues are lying and how the statistics is working so again select the project for which project you want to so this project i've created in my private section so it is visible for me only but after creating it's very much possible to share with others as well so this project priority wise defect total Ascending order and now Now you can see whatever defect app selected is generated with this order So let's create with the bubble chart as well. So again the project name required participants uh, Definitely for 12 weeks. If you will click on 15 minutes, whatever activity is done from the back end or from the any user, it will be automatically updated within 15 minutes. So you can see bubble charts are generated. So there is not having much data because of that, it's showing like that. But when we have thousands of data, definitely it will show up within some result so by this way we can create our dashboards which look like uh, it's a first impression when we logged in we'll see the status of any project how it is working how many defects are open how many closed how many resolved we can track it easily and this is the showcase which, which we can share or uh, present with the top notch as well so by this way we have created attractive and um, very uh, interesting dashboard in Jira. So hope you liked it. If you really enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Thank you for watching.